It is almost the weekend. And tonight, our Stephanie Olmo is checking out an event where you can get some colorful work done. A big tattoo festival coming to town. People coming in from all over, and we are getting a sneak peek at the setup. Well, if you're a fan of Body Ink, I promise you, you're not going to want to miss this one. It's one of the most unique tattoo conventions there is, and it's all being held at the Arizona Biltmore Resort this weekend. And guess what? We're here to get a little glimpse into the world of tattoos. So, are you ready for Hell City? our 11th year actually coming back to the Billmore so it keeps growing every year uh, we see more people coming you know joining the tattoo family and, and, and really checking out what we have to offer here we have a lot of things to offer we have some of the world's best tattoo artists we have over 250 of the world's best tattoo artists we have uh, live bands uh, live freak shows um, aerial acts you know, live painting exhibitions it's just a really good collection of a lot of unique events that you won't find at any other event here in Arizona it's all pretty much going to be jam-packed in three days Three days. Three days of action, nonstop. A dream convention for tattoo lovers. People come here to add to their tattoo collection and to get tattooed by people they normally can't get tattooed by. We have people from all over the world. So people you're seeing, you know, in the magazines, we have a lot of ink masters from television here. So it's a collection of artists you can't normally find under one roof. Amongst those in attendance will be artists from Divinity Tattoo in Phoenix. Oh, it's a great honor for us to be a part of that show. Uh, we've been there since the very beginning since the very first one and uh you know we've been to the hell city in ohio which is where it originated paolo acuna enjoys bringing his art to life on people's bodies i try and make my tattoos kind of like my paintings that's what i enjoy doing larger body work tell me what is it you are getting back there it's a woman that represents being a mother the, the things you learn in life when doing that, so it's kind of a lot of different things all mixed that Paulo did for me. You definitely uh, went all out this time around. Absolutely. Go big or go home, right? All right, Sam, so I don't have a single tattoo on my body. So I was thinking about getting something. Now when you see me, what do you think my first tattoo should be? When you look at me, what do you think? Like a butterfly, a flower, or an angel, or what? I look like a Fox News girl to me, so why not? Fox 10 News Girl. I like it. All right, um, I'm kind of scared, but let's do this. <laughs> oh my God, here we go. Oh goodness. <laughs> Girl. Uh, we've got her for life now. Yeah. Fox 10, I love yes, it. Yes, yes. She's uh, obviously not inked after that. She would have been crying with the pain, right? <laughs> <laughs> okay, if you had, I know you don't have, I, I'm assuming you don't, I haven't seen everything, but I'm assuming you don't have a tattoo. Really? <laughs> I'm guessing you don't. If you had to have one, what would you tattoo? Oh, no. Oh, man. Boy, I'm I have no you. idea. Mom, I have no idea. You know, just the old-fashioned... I have no idea. Okay, well, think about it. You're kind of a rock and roller. I'm surprised you don't have like a... a no, no ink. No ink. It, well, it's just something you would do. But I had you for a second. You weren't quite sure. I would, yeah. Well, I was worried, actually. You? Trending in. No. Okay. No. Trending now.